Hi YouTube, today I'm doing a Barbie bouquet. This is my first time doing this one, so I'm really, really nervous, but I really, really hope it come out hot. I have it in my head. I will tell y'all where I get everything from along the video, so let's get into it. So today we're doing a Barbie bouquet, but I'm not sure if I could like strip the Barbie on camera, so I'm gonna do it off camera. And I'll show y'all after. But this is the size phone block I'm using for the small bouquet from the Dollar Tree. And I got my Barbie from Hobby Lobby. I had to do that off camera. I wasn't sure if they was going to ban me or not. So this is what I came up with. I did tape it in the inside. Okay. And I did make it higher than my $1 bill. So when I stick it in, the um my lighter would be higher. You know what? I don't even need to see her. Uh, she really can stand up. But I did make it higher than my um my bill. Okay. I don't know if I'm just They will be linked in the description on my Amazon storefront if y'all would like to purchase them. Link in the description. Okay. So I'm just going to use five of them. She asked me, can I do like two-tone, like hot pink? She want hot pink and um, hot pink and soft pink. So I'm just going to mix them together and do both of them. And I should have had my tape already ready, but I didn't. Again, I did my Barbie higher than my dollar bill so she could like stand out more. And with my flowers, I'm just gonna put a extra piece of stick on it because the stem is kind of flimsy. So I'm just gonna tape the stick to it so it can be straight. Get you another stick and just tape it on, tape it together. Uh, and my sticks, uh, I don't remember what inch they are, but. It don't have to be like the whole length of the uh, flower, just like half. You just wanted to secure it, that's all. So it won't move when you're applying it. One, two, three, four. Oh, I did too many pieces of tape. Which is okay. Okay, so this is how my sticks 
well how my flowers look after I put the sticks on them. Okay. And again, I got these from Amazon. Super cute, right? My flowers from Hobby Lobby. And I'm just going to stick these between each um, rose. And hopefully it come out how I want it to, how I have it in my head. That's just what I'm thinking about. I don't know how many I'm going to use, but I'm just going to fix them all. I want the pretty ones. Okay, that should be enough. And you want it to be longer. Same size. The same size. Because they're going to be side by side. So I want them to be the same size. Which means I'll have to break my stick right about here. And I'm going to break all my sticks the same size. Okay, and I'm gonna just do these off camera. Well, no, y'all can stay. I don't have a lot to do. Y'all can stay. Y'all can stay. Y'all can stay. Y'all can stay. I just hope it come out. I, I want it to come. <laughs> I, I want it to come out. I'm gonna be so mad if it don't. Fingers crossed, let's hope so. I'm almost done. Making my sticks even. Okay. Now the sticks are even, same size. And now this, it has a hole at the bottom already. So I'm just going to push it through the hole. Just like that. And it's not going to come off. It's already on. So no worries about that. And again, y'all, I probably don't need all of these flowers, but... I'm just going to do them anyway to be on the safe side. So I don't want to keep stopping the video. Going back. Doing it. Y'all know I always run out of storage. I always run out of storage. Oh, I grabbed the right amount of sticks. I know that's right. Okay, and this is how it looks when all of them are on the stick. Okay. Now, I want to stick my Barbie directly in the middle. Please don't fall, Barbie. Wait, let me put another stick in the front of her to secure her. Oh, wait, I gotta take this out. Okay, wait, I gotta put another piece of tape on. Oh, look, I already have it. I'm gonna do it off camera. I don't wanna give in. Hold on. I don't need to give in. Okay, so now she's secured in the front and in the back. Okay, so I'm gonna put her in the middle. Okay, perfect. Now I'm gonna try, let me put your arms up baby. Try to wrap the roses like around her. I wanna wrap the roses around her. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna do the good ones first. Two. 
through. Okay, the five was perfect. Going around here, the five was perfect. Okay. Okay. And again, y'all, this is my centerpiece that I'm doing. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with the hot pink and just put them like right on the edge of it. Just giving it a blend of both. All the way around. I didn't even need all them. I knew that. Put your arm one more time, but I'm making not me acting like I'm talking to somebody for real. Okay. That is super cute. That's my centerpiece, y'all. Let me show y'all. Look at my centerpiece. So, so cute. Okay, now I can start wrapping the money around it. This one. So, now I'm going to start wrapping the bouquet. And again, this is $30, but if I need more ones, because I never did it like my centerpiece like this before. I always do it the same way. So if I need more ones, I will just throw extra ones in. But originally, it's supposed to be a small $30 bouquet. So I'm going to start here. I'm gonna squeeze this somewhere, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I have to squeeze it somewhere to make it an even 30. And I think it's gonna be right here. It has to be the, the whole 30. Okay. 
30. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So that's 30. Okay, super, super cute. All right. That's a $30 one. I'm so happy. <laughs> it's so cute and I'm not even done. What is? I'm not even done. My ribbon come from Walmart. This is the size of it on the back. I don't know if y'all can see that. But Walmart. So I can't flip it over because the Barbie is already in. So I have to do my ribbon different this time. So I'm just going to do it across the top. And these is not my good scissors. Brilliant. I don't know where the other ones are. So I'm just going to pull it. Here, I don't really want to cover the flowers. I don't want to cover my flowers. Okay, so I'm just going to Okay. And when you make your own ribbon, what is that? Is something sticky on there, y'all? Hold on, let me cut another piece because I don't know what that is. Something sticky. I'm not having it. And I already printed my um happy birthday princess. This is what I'm gonna iron on the ribbon. Happy birthday princess. It's going on the ribbon. And I'm gonna show y'all how to do that. With this part to iron on, you will need a mini handheld cricket. Okay, you will need one of these. So let me show y'all how to do that. I'm just gonna find my center and put it directly in the middle. Oh, and this was eight across and 140 down. If you have a cricket machine, you know what I'm talking about. If not, I will teach y'all, but it's eight across, 1.45 down, okay? So I'm just gonna find, can y'all see me? I'm gonna turn this way so y'all can see. So I'm just gonna find the center. So just like that. And now I'm gonna iron it on using my Cricut mini hand here. And when you do this part, you do want to put pressure on it so it can get stuck on the ribbon. My Divana I use is a cool pill, so I am going to take a few seconds to let it cool before I peel it off. By the way, y'all, it is, uh, I think, 10, 9, I don't know. It's nighttime. And I've been woke since, like, 7 something, so I'm really, really tired. If y'all hear it in my voice, I'm really, really tired. But, of course, I'm going to still make y'all videos, so. Okay, so now I'm going to let it cool off before I peel it off. I'm going to peel it off. Alright, so 
and that's how it came out. Super, super cute. And now I'm going to iron it again. Go over it again just to make sure. Flatten it back out. It's all the way secured on the ribbon. Okay, my ribbon is complete. And that's how it looks. Hey, in my last video told me that I was cutting it wrong. I had to fold it and cut it at the same time. So I'm gonna do it like this. Making it even on both sides. Okay. And then I'm going to cut it even again. And now I'm going to make like the B shape. I probably did it wrong again, but she'll tell me in the comments. <laughs> I'm sure she'll tell me. I'm still learning, so you know. So this is how the ribbon looks now. Okay. With both of the ends cut. It's cute to me. So I got these pins from Amazon. They also will be linked in the description below on my Amazon for my Amazon storefront. And I'm just gonna put two. I'm gonna use two, one on each side. Last time I tried this, it gave me a hard time, but hey. I still got the job done, right? Don't judge me. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to put it through. I'm going to put it through here. And then put it through my bill. Okay. Use it back up. Use it back Okay. Like that. And I'm gonna do the other side. Can y'all see? Are you still showing? There you go. I'm gonna do the other side the same exact way. Just like right here. Pushing it through the bill. Maybe I should have squeezed it up, huh? Let me see. I'll scoot it back. What y'all think? It's okay like that. This one will go back because it's not going to go. This one. Oh, I dropped it. I really just be talking to myself, y'all, so I'm sorry. It's a habit now. <laughs> it's really a habit now. Okay, just like that. Perfect, 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 perfect. I'm gonna put you down. There you go. Okay, that's perfect. Okay, this one kind of curved to the side, so. I just wanna straighten out a little bit more. Okay, so happy birthday, princess. And like the princess, like point to it, you know, like happy birthday. Okay, 
So yeah, that's that part. And now I'm going to use my, these are actually patches that I have, but I'm going to use them as if they are stickers. And I got these from Hobby Lobby. Okay. Hobby Lobby, Hobby Lobby, Hobby Lobby. These are real iron on patches, literally. And it already has a sticker on there, but I'm gonna stick an extra sticker on it, the double-sided tape. To just secure it more. Okay. My double-sided tape I got from Dollar Tree. So I think I wanna put one here, like Barbie. I don't want it like in the back. And just like here. Barbie there, and then I'm gonna do the other one on the other side. This one has sticky stuff on it already as well, and of course I'm gonna use more to secure the Barbie. You have to secure the Barbie, okay? And I'm gonna put this one on this side in the same spot. It's like right here, right? I didn't even need it on the other end. Let me just get another. Just like that, okay? So now let's wrap it. So my paper come from Amazon. And it will be linked in the description below. My Amazon link will be linked below. Okay, so the lines or your guided lines, they're very, very helpful when wrapping your paper. So you wanna start from the right hand corner. Start from the right hand. Uh, they stuck together, hold on. Okay, and follow your guided line in the middle. The point and the line should always meet. Okay. So I'm gonna put it all the way up like that. Spreading it out. And this one is your crossover guy. And crossover guy, you're just gonna cross it over. Just like that. Giving yourself four points. And I'm using my double-sided tape for this one. Four points. One, two, three, four. Always, always, always. And however many rolls you use for your bouquet, that's how many pieces of the floral paper you use. So I use three rolls. Well, normally my smalls are three rolls. So three rolls would be three pieces of paper. I'm sorry, a small bouquet is three pieces of paper. So I'm using three to wrap around my bouquet. This wrapping uh might be a little more to the <laughs> Okay, four pieces of paper always. I mean four points always. I'm sorry, y'all tired. Please don't hold it against me. Please don't, please don't, please don't. Okay. Start from the right hand corner, following your guide line in the middle, your point and your line should meet just like that. And you go straight up. Okay. And we're gonna flatten it out. This is your crossover guide. You just cross it right over. And double sided tape. Okay, 
Okay, so that's all three pieces of paper that I'm using, floral paper that I'm using to wrap my bouquet with. And this is what it looks like. So now the hard part is wrapping it because I never um, had some sticking out of the bouquet while I wrapped it. So I have to get that part together. <laughs> I got my pens from Amazon as well. My Amazon link is linked in the description below each video. Okay. So, yeah, the cheat code to this part is you need something heavy, something real, real heavy. Well, not too heavy, but something heavy to sit around your bouquet to hold the paper up for you. Okay. Again, I normally flip it upside down, but I cannot flip it upside down this time because the Barbie is sticking out. So, I just have to go in and just fill it in. <laughs> so, I'm going to just go like this. I'm going to push my spray. <gasps> See what I'm saying? <laughs> push that up push that up okay so push this back. okay so i'm gonna pin it here i should have brought y'all down ah i should have brought y'all down so y'all can see okay i need you to be flat Okay, so that side is done. I'm gonna go around the whole bouquet, doing it the same exact way. Okay. And this one. Here. Push my spray paint up against it. And I'm using my stick pen. To stick it in. Y'all don't say I ain't never taught y'all my trick. Okay. Never say it. <laughs> okay. And the last one. I'm gonna put it here. Pushing this side over there, this side over there, so I can see where I need to put my pen. And I'm gonna stick it right in the middle. Done. <laughs> now for the next part. So now I'm gonna wrap the bouquet. This part I will need, you will need, I'm sorry, a stapler and the double sided tape. So I'm gonna start from I'm gonna start from the back, y'all. I am gonna start from the back. And wherever you tape it, that's where you staple it, okay? And again, I am using my double-sided tape for this part. Y'all can see. Oh, y'all can't see. I'm going to show y'all the front. I'm sorry. I promise I will show y'all the front. Go all the way around. Okay, this part. And you have to pull it as you go. If you decide to do it, well, if you do it this way with an object in the middle, you have to pull it. Okay, double sided tape. And staple. Oh, it's stuck in my hand, y'all. Okay. Can y'all, y'all can't see what I'm doing. Not really. Not really. Okay, the last part. I don't need those pins anymore. 
I did this side, did this one. So this should be the last part that should be open. Move my cans back. Move my cans, y'all. Move my cans. Okay. So you always leave one side open. So if I have gaps in the inside, I can always pull it together. Okay. So now I'm just gonna pull these together, making sure there's no gaps in the middle anywhere. And now I'm gonna tape it. Use my double sided tape. Tape it first. Tape it. <laughs> and that's that. Okay. Do I want to tape it? Staple it. Okay, I am going to staple it. Just to be on the safe side. I'm going to staple it. Okay. So this is what my bouquet looks like from the top. All right. Now let's put it in the can. I was going to use a white can, but I changed my mind. Like, I just wanted to flow with the pink. So, put your hot glue at the bottom. Oh, it's not ready. It's not ready. It's not ready. It's not ready. I need to get... Okay. Okay, there we go. I was going to say it's not hot enough, but I got it. Okay, hot glue at the bottom of the can. Then you want to use an extra piece of... Okay, all right. You want to use an extra piece of paper to stick at the bottom. And push it straight in the middle. Down straight in the middle, straight in the middle. Put it out. Okay, now I'm going to use the rocks to give you weight. My rocks come from Dollar Tree. And again, this is for weight purposes only. Just to give you weight. Put your hot glue in. You're going to put it around the rim of it. The trimming, the rim, however you want to call it. I make them my own words all the time, y'all. Don't judge me. But you want to put the um the hot glue around it, making the hot glue fall in the inside of the can. Okay. Let me find a bag. Okay, it's the bag. Okay. So I'm just going to put the hot glue all the way around. I, you can put however much glue you want to put. I just go around mm, four or five times. Probably be more. <laughs> I always run out of glue. I mean, out of glue. You have to put another one in. It always happens. And you want the glue to fall inside the can so the foam can get stuck on it. Okay, let me drop y'all down because I messed up yesterday. Okay, so you want to put your bouquet straight down. Yeah, okay, push it all the way down in the can. You want it real, real flat on each side, okay. Hold it down on each side, pushing it flat inside of the can. 
Okay. So y'all see the sticks? So this paper is to hide that. Because it's going to go up to hide that. Okay. Make sure each side is flat. Flat as possible. To cover the sticks that's showing, you just pull your paper up. Okay, pull it up, 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 all the way around. Up, 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 up. Okay, and now I'm going to start taping it by the points first. I always do my points first. And again, you always do it this way to cover the sticks. In the foam so it won't show. Okay, now all my points are covered. So now I can go back in and just tape what I want to tape so it can look how I want it to look. <laughs> I guess you could say I'm too close. Okay. So I'm going to go here. Y'all see that big cap? That's the no-no. We're not going to use that like that, are we? And I'm going to do one more on this side. one here. Okay. I think I'm going to put one here. Not going to lie. I didn't like how it looked. At all. Okay, so now let's show y'all the final look. This is the final look. Let me get y'all up close. Say happy birthday, princess. The little Barbie. This is super, super cute. I don't know why the flowers look red, but they're actually hot pink. That's hot pink. I don't know why they look red. But let me know in the comments how y'all feel about this one. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification so y'all can be notified every single time I drop another video. Let me know if y'all want me to do more of these. This was okay. I liked it, this one. It wasn't... Like, as hard as I thought it would be. So. I really like this one. It's super, super cute. And it's set up like that. That is so cute. Happy birthday, princess. 
Oh god, he's... Okay, y'all, guess what? I gotta go to work at 6 o'clock in the morning. And it's maybe like 11 at night. <laughs> so I have to get some rest, okay? Thank y'all for watching. And y'all have a great night, a great tomorrow, a great Sunday. Have a great day. Thank you.